today's tutorial we are going to see how to remove any video background with the help of Filmora 12. So let's begin. First uh, Wondershare Filmora will open this pop up once you click on the shortcut like this and then you need to select the aspect ratio for this for the sake of this video I am keeping it 16 is to 9. So I will open the new project. Next step is to bring my files into the project um, uh, media. So I will have to click on this and select the respective files. And then I am going to import some background clips. Suppose let me take these two. Okay. So we have got two backgrounds and three such videos. First thing is just bring the video on the timeline. Take another track out here. So I will have to come here and add a video track. Now next thing is just minimize the scale and check the length and then go and bring this file again okay and since this file length is still here I am going to give a cut by keeping my playhead here and just pressing on this scissor button and then select the rest of the part and get rid of it. So this is the first step next is keep my upper layer selected which is the main video which i want to uh, like re replace the background with this so keep it selected come to this uh, this panel where you have three four options like first option is video under video we have basics and then it is mask i'm not going to show you right now how to do the masking here we are going to go to all tools option and enable the chroma key toggle as soon as you enable it it will automatically capture the main background color which is green and it will automatically get replaced with the other uh, like background which we have actually actually selected so once you are done with this you can export this file by clicking on this export button and here you can give a name to the respective file and I am going to select the directory where I want to skip it. Then recommended resolution this is the frame rate 25 FPS, FPS this is the frame rate we have chosen. And 1920 to 1080 is the resolution we have chosen so this is uh, what uh, we are going to keep and just export it. So it will automatically get exported. You can see the export uh, exporting percentage here and it is done. Okay. That's it. Now let us get rid of this first project and let us take the second project. Why well, I am going to use this video in the second track and I am going to take this background in the first track. Select the like the part which is required to replace the main video. You can right click and split it or the way I have shown you for the first video you can use that and simply press delete. This is having different colors at the background right. So I will select this then I will go to all tools option. Then see there are three four options in AI tools. Well, one is the chroma key which we have used previously but for this video chroma key will not work. Instead we will have to enable AI portrait. As soon as you enable AI portrait, no matter however color is there at the back end, it will be removing all those colors with the help of AI. So once this is done, again same way you can export it. This is the second option. The third option is, I am going to take this in the second track. The same video which is having different kind, kind of uh, different color backgrounds. Next I am going to take some image from the stock. So there are some beautiful uh, gradient uh, background which I have. So I'm going to replace this background with this gradient or this red background. So let me just uh, like I have come to this stock media from my download folder. I have got all these backgrounds. Let me try this one okay. Place the playhead, give a cut and delete it. This is the first thing. Second, select the main video. Go to mask. Now I am going to show you how do I replace this with another option which is not AI which is masking. Okay. So I will have to go for masking and go to this draw mask option. Once it is draw mask option you will get one pen which will help you to draw a mask. So try to bring the lines as close as possible around the main figure so that your edges are secured. So finally I will come and you will have to 
join it together and boom the background is removed now you can play and check one effect you must give that is this blood strength i will just add a little bit of blood strength okay this is how you can do a masking masking works really well when there is no background so if i remove this background then uh, you can just check with another background which is having some uh, you know decent color so this is white and i'm going to stretch it till end and there where it gives a better appeal so thank you so much if you have liked my video please do give me a big thumbs up and if you're new visitor to my channel please consider to uh, press the subscription button below and press the bell icon next to it if you haven't watched other videos related to video editing you will get it at the end screen today this much i will come back with some fun tutorial next week till then stay safe stay legendary